TitleMatchNetwork.com. Yeah, it, we did a lot of stuff with Sullivan because, uh, you know, Kevin, man, Kevin has got a vivid imagination. Uh, I'm, right. You can see this stuff, you know, that, that he's come up with. Uh, I don't know. Have, have you gotten, I've a, seen have you gotten to speak with him? And, Not yet. Yeah, well, it, We'd like to, that, that'll that be interesting because, uh, you know, he's uh, Kevin is, can really be, you know, a straightforward, you know, guy. You can right. sit and talk to him, you know, like we're talking. But it's when it comes to business, you know, his mind is he's he's intelligent. But with the stuff he comes up with, sometimes it's just so outrageous. <laughs> you know, he was like the I don't know, like like the devil's advocate or something. But. You know, he just had this idea. He said, "Hey, you know, let's just have this run-in with the with the Wyndham Mulligan family." You know, so uh, my old man, Blackjack Mulligan, and then you know, it, most wrestling fans knew because then you know, after had me in the uh, wrestling magazines, and uh, you, know, you know, I was in them, you know, kind of frequently then. So, so it, true fans knew, you know, that Blackjack was my father. So, you know, there was really no problem you know, with him being Mulligan and me being Wyndham, right. you know, it was just uh, a lot of, uh, a lot of the fictitious names, you know, that guys use, you know, now they're kind of returned back to the style of using guys, real names. And that's, you know, it has, it has its good points and it's bad points, but that was one thing that I always believed in was, you know, just using your real name and then you create your character in the ring. I think the reason that Kendall, you know, did, did start wrestling is because of, uh, you know, Kevin Sullivan was, you know, wanted to do the family thing in Florida. And that was, you know, that was 85 ish or 86, I think, you know, and Sullivan was, was still around there. You know, he had been, he had been through, uh, you know, a couple of, a couple of different bookers and all, but, uh, let's see, I'm trying to get my dates right here. Because I mean, you know, this is a it's a long timeline. <laughs> huh. Anyway, Kendall was you know was was thinner and skinnier than I was when, when I started, but you know it was already kind of established. You know that 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 was what we did there in Florida. You know, there you were, you're a kid. Okay, we'll, we'll you get to learn in the ring. So Kendall, what I did is I, I went down to uh, the sportatorium with him. And, uh, uh, you know, that there are some other guys that helped him, you know, that trained with him, you know, I, was one of them. yeah, uh, hero, hero trained Kendall. And, and, uh, that, that's that, the name I was trying to think of while, a uh, while ago was, uh, Jimmy Tanaka Okay. and, uh, and, uh, and the younger one too, but, uh, the Tanaka boys, but, uh, uh Pat Tanaka. Yeah. Yeah. Pat Tanaka. Pat's a crazy one. Oh yeah. Jimmy was the one that took off and sailed around the world on a sailboat. When he flipped out, he did something constructive. You know, <laughs> he he right. sailed around the world. But uh, uh, tell me where I was. We were just talking about your brother. And okay. Yeah. Well, Kendall, it just it just kind of rolled right into it. So so, but he was there every day. You know, he 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 got in the he got in the ring up there at the, at the sportatorium, and then when uh, they thought he was ready. You know, when he when when he learned how to take a bump, okay, that was it. That was his that was his spot. He he was my little brother. He was Black Jack's son, and Sullivan and them just you know got heat on him. You know, so man, they pounded him to death. You know, and you know there he was. Man, I'm afraid to say how much he weighed when he started. You know, but you know he was he was. Uh, I don't know. I don't know which one of us started at a younger age. I think that I started a little younger than he did. But uh, after that, you know, he just learned in the ring and, and he stayed, you know, he stayed kind of skinny for a while. You know, I think he took a little bit more after my mom's side of the family. Now, you know, now uh, uh, we'll come around to it. But Kennel weighs 290 pounds now. And it's, you know, he's got a shaved head. He looks like a monster, man. He trains hard. And, and when people see him, you know, they go, geez, right. gee, <laughs> you're Kendall Wyndham, man. I remember you and you were that big around, <laughs> you know, and they say that to me too. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so, you know, I remember you were that big around and, and, and it's funny, you know, guys, guys, my age, you know, come up to me, 
you know, of course, like, you know, I've, I've already said it about the hair, but, you know, a guy with, with gray hair, you know, come and say, man, yeah, I remember just seeing you when I was in junior high, you <laughs> wrestling. And yeah, I know I just got, I'd say, you know, how old are you, man? How old are you? He said, oh, I'm, I'm 41. I said, well, you know, I was the same age as you. So, you know, wow. <laughs> I was, I was in the ring and you were going to school. So, you know, but, you know, they, people forget, you know, you know, the timelines, you, you know, the, he could have been in college and, you know, it's just, it's just fun, funny the way people remember you, you know, they, they just, a lot of people out there think that I'm older than I am, but it's, it's just, it's wrestling age, you know, it's how long I've been on TV and how long I've been doing it, you know, so it's. TitleMatchNetwork.com.